What is going on, everybody? It is Foreign, and welcome back to 2v Tuesdays with Geraldus. Yo, how's it going, everybody? That was really creepy. So, <laughs> I had this idea for a topic this week, and it was for us to talk about different game modes that we'd like to see in Titanfall. Uh, the two of us, we've been playing a lot of Titanfall lately. Uh, I would say that that takes up the majority of our gaming time. Am I correct? Mm, I don't know, man. I've been playing a lot of Monopoly by myself. <laughs> yeah, I bet, I bet you that's a lot of fun. <laughs> um, <laughs> I always actually, win. That probably would be fun. Um, so we decided to actually come up with uh, different game modes that we'd like to see. Uh, not necessarily things that are already in the game, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Uh, and kind of pulling from some things that we've played in other games. Um, so, anyways, to get right into it, one of the game modes that I would like to see added into this is uh, is a King of the Hill. I know that in a lot of other games, um, for instance, we had Black Ops 2 where there was hard point, where the point continuously moves around the map with, at a time limit. Um, there's also yeah. Halo, which is really big for King of the Hill. Uh, I think that something like that would be really fun, especially like having the addition of Titans. I don't know how big King of the Hill was in Halo. I think that was still mostly just people played Slayer. No, I know. I know that Slayer was like the big thing, or Capture the Flag was another big thing. Yeah. But I don't know. I really, I really enjoy game modes where there is a central objective, and people are constantly running to it. No, I like that too. And the for me though, the only concern I would have with Titanfall would be, you know, if if you were really getting beat on by a team and <laughs> they just covered the entire hill in Titans. But then again. They could put some of the hills inside, so you had to get out of your Titan. So it like alternated between inside and outside hills, which I think would be cool. Yeah, that would be a great idea. And then you also don't have like the bullshit with like, uh, for instance, Black Ops, uh, Black Ops Two, when you would play Hardpoint, you don't have to worry about fucking kill streaks coming in, like blowing you up. Like you could literally get there and just hold it down and wait till they come. Um, and then something to make this actually better than previous ones is to make it random when you when you actually add in like a set order that they switch to it just becomes like all right everyone run to that point get ready 20 seconds early because they're not actually coming for us anymore and it, i don't know i would like to see it where it's more of um a, a randomized thing where it could be anywhere yeah or even if it just split it between like so you knew it was going to go to one point or one other point. You know, if it was just a 50-50 chance of where it was going to be. Or I don't know if I'd want it to be completely random. Because it was completely random, it could go from, you know, right here, back to another place, right here, back to another place. Just keep going to the same two spots right next to each other the whole time. That'd be pretty shitty. Yeah, no, I... And obviously, like, I'm sure that there's ways that they can figure that out. Like, whereas it's not going from point one to point two to point three to point four, where it goes from one to three to four to two to five to... Eight, yeah, where it still hits know. every spot on the map or something. Yeah, so it you know. more hits, like, a random a random number in, like, the sequence, but it doesn't actually, like... It can't go from, like, one to two to one to two to one to two. Yeah. Yeah, you I know. think that would be good. I think that would be a fun game type, too. That would be really boring. Um, and then I had another one, and then you somewhat stole it. And that was a convoy idea. So. Yeah, I mean, well, you're you you want to escort like a VIP guy, like a like an like an NPC across the map. Oh yeah, yeah. There was that. That was uh, another one that I had. Where, um, if any of you guys have played the campaign, which if you haven't, I suggest you do one because you unlock the other titans, and two because it's, it's fun. Um, most of the players are kind of bad, so it's it's a good way to get into the game. Yeah. Um, but on random missions, you'll have, like, different sergeants and colonels in Titans around you, and I thought that it would be an interesting game mode where you kind of take that aspect and bring it into an actual, um, you know, multiplayer sequence, competitive, whatever, you know what I'm trying to say. Yeah. You basically bring it into multiplayer, and you have, like, an NPC that you have to protect as they go from point A to point B. Etc. Etc. And the other team also has someone that goes from point A to point B, and you can choose to defend or you can choose to uh, to attack. Basically. So the thing is, though, like that NPC guy that's in Titans in the campaign always dies right away. Well, it it dies right away if everyone just kills it right away. 
Because yeah. that was always the problem is no one else had Titans out. It's not an actual person. So all you do is jump on its back and shoot its brains out. Yeah. And it was done in like 20 seconds. If that. Pretty much. You know what would be a cool game type? Sorry, this is, this is your video about it. But I think uh, there should be one where there's like a big walled in area outside, right? And then you're, you, one guy, you stand on top of a building and you call in your Titan and you see how many people you can crush. Yeah. <laughs> It'd be that would, that it wouldn't would be really be a game fun. type. Uh, what was the other one that we said jokingly? Oh yeah, where um, <laughs> the, the you're pilots the size... are huge and the titans are really yeah. small. <laughs> yeah, the pilots are the size of titans. Uh, yeah. I think that would be awesome. <laughs> <laughs> They'd be like jumping super high and shit. They couldn't wall run or anything because there's just no walls big enough. They're just jumping everywhere. Well, no, they would have the functionality of of the titans. That's no. all that they would be able to do. No, they would have to have the functionality of the pilots and the titans would have to have the functionality of the titans but be really small <laughs> they'd just be really shitty the game mode would be fucking horrible Dude, it would take so long for a titan to get from one end to the other <laughs> yeah and his guns would sound hilarious like they gotta make his guns like super high pitched cause he'd be tiny nuclear ejection oh god they need to add that right now please <laughs> that would be really really funny it would also just be really funny to like make a parody of that yeah no doubt. It's Both possible. Shot. It's possible. Um, I could have swore that I had some other ones to talk about, but I can't I can't really remember. Um, but anyways, I mean, most of this stuff obviously isn't going to come for a while. Uh, I know that they still have private matches that they need to add in um, where we can start playing fun, wacky game modes anyways. Hopefully we'll have, like, pretty open customization as to what we can do. Yeah, I mean, that's how... I guess Infinity Ward never, though, when they were still with Infinity Ward, they were never really that good at doing that. <laughs> so, I mean... But they're also not, though. They're, it's a different group of people, and I feel like they're... I feel like they understand that Call of Duty doesn't listen to the community, and that they're going to listen to the community. I mean, so far they are. I mean, I don't... The things that they're adding, though, that the community wants are just things that should have been there to begin with. Private matches, for instance, should have been in there from the get-go. Being they able really to should change have, your your class outs. names, yeah, your loadout yeah. names. Yeah, that's that's one thing that was kind of like really you didn't add that in to begin with. Yeah, <laughs> it's so. just fucking silly. Um, but yeah, I mean, other than that though, man, like the game so far has been super smooth, and I like the game modes that are in it. But they need to add the little tiny Titan game mode, and the 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 get the Titan and run across the map game mode, and then I think the game will be absolutely flawless. Yeah. That'd be fun. Oh, you get um, you so have anyways, to get across the map to get into a tiny titan and run your tiny titan all the way across the map. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that'd be funny. So, anyways, that is all that we have time for. Uh, be sure to go check out Geraldus' channel. Um, you can tell them where to go. Uh, YouTube.com forward slash Geraldus for all your Black Ops 2 gaming news and information. <laughs> <laughs> Click the link in the description. Yes, no annotations. Uh, anyways, that's all we have time for. See you guys next week. Bye. Love ya.